also known as Al. Not only he's a photographer, he is also a painter. But his painting material is not common as you are thinking. His painting material is May I have your attention please? Thank you very much for coming to this uh, beautiful place that is the place of my good friends, William and Liz. And uh, I should really, uh, I, you, you probably, many of you don't know them. So I should tell you that uh, they're very generous to have offered their, uh, their house for everyone to be here. So eye opening is, it could be in the literal sense, opening the eye and in the metaphorical sense opening your mind so accepting maybe other cultures other uh, uh, you know other ideas just opening up and uh, and absorbing whatever is diverse so uh, actually my art I consider myself as an archivist so artist and activist and um, by that I mean I like that my uh, art has a message for the people for peace, for justice, and um, actually this is one example that was the opening uh, picture, and it is, uh, this is the allegory of eye-opening. Just only a couple of weeks before the exhibition, I made a call for, uh, for, uh, for people with beautiful eyes, and I got Sophie here to pose, to pose for this picture with uh, this zipper that I made myself. So nothing is manipulated. It was just a picture taken that way. Sophie, tell us what you uh, think. Sophie is studying to become a judge, by the way. And we know that justice is uh, blind. Tell us about that. La justice est aveugle. Donc, la fermeture éclair se ferme quand on prend le jugement. Voilà. <laughs> so, uh, over here, we have uh, the picture of Emma, she's not here right now, and a friend of mine. And uh, this one shows, uh, you see, it shows black and white, right? And it shows um, coexistence in a way, right? And, and if, you, if you look closer, you see, if you zoom in, you would notice eyes of people from all around the world that I've taken, more than 400 people. And eyes from like Latinos, Chinese, uh, Mexicans, uh, everywhere, Europeans. So that's the idea of diversity that we can all, we're all made of, if you want, atoms or uh, components. Laissez-moi vous introduire Maria, Maria qui nous vient de Yerevan. Que pensez-vous de cette magnifique exposition, Maria euh, Quels sont vos mots Moi, je trouve que l'objectif de l'expo est atteint parce que c'est une exposition qui est supposée ouvrir le regard et l'œil sur, sur les choses, comme le nom l'indique, eye opening. Et je trouve que il y a beaucoup d'œuvres qui sont qui représentent des choses qu'on auxquelles on n'aurait pas pensé, donc euh, qui vraiment nous ouvrent le, le regard sur des, sur des nouvelles choses. Et euh, je suis personnellement très sensible euh, à l'œil humain et au regard, parce que ça porte beaucoup de, beaucoup de choses, ça communique beaucoup d'informations, des émotions. Donc euh, moi, ça m'a beaucoup touché. Vos yeux communiquent beaucoup aussi. Merci. Quelle est votre œuvre préférée par vous 
profit is going to be uh, dedicated to uh, Child of Universe, uh, which is a, a big project that's going to rebuild Africa and all the universities and schools in Africa. And uh, looking forward. success rate and when African children can have a higher enrollment rate. So this is the reason why I created this project and I'm very honored that tonight uh, Al and I are putting this uh, photo exhibition together to bring a, some kind of awareness uh, here in Paris among you know, these beautiful guests that we have tonight but also we have a major uh, global campaign uh, to promote the Child of the Universe project. You know, we're here in a very, very big city, a lot of people, but it's, it's tough to connect, but we're here to get to know people we haven't known before, different backgrounds, and you know, we're all here together, and so we're all part of a, now a circle of friends, so uh, welcome. Liz, anything to... I think William probably uh, said it all, very well stated, but I just want to, you know, uh, reiterate that we just have two visionaries here, one with the camera and his art, and another with his projects all over the world. And I'm just thrilled to welcome them into our home, their work into our home, and, and you all into our home. So welcome, and uh, thank you for being here tonight. Maybe five years ago, I was in um, Bloomington, Indiana, in the States, and I was um, having coffee, waiting for a friend to come, but uh, she didn't make it. So with the leftovers, the coffee that she didn't uh, drink, I started um, uh, sketching her uh, portrait. And, uh, and I, well, it sounds funny, but uh, I was just uh, sketching with, uh, with just some uh, espresso coffee, really dense espresso coffee. It has very nice, as you see, very nice uh, sepia tones, and uh, it has uh, uh, some kind of uh, shininess. Bonsoir. Vous êtes très belle aussi. Oui, des photos et euh, un peu de peinture avec du café. Magnifique. 